Fucking hell. I enjoy mushrooms as much as the next person. So, no, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's fun. I've, I've just moved house. Um, didn't want to, it was like a council decision. And, uh, <laughs> what it is, we got these neighbours right, we had a bit of a fallout. They'd only been there a couple of weeks. And uh, anyway, I, I asked my new neighbour uh, if you noticed all the cat shit that suddenly started appearing on my lawn since they moved in. And his reaction, it wasn't very good, it was quite hostile with you, but very negative, very negative. And then three days later, he asked me if I'd seen his cat. <laughs> <laughs> my reply was very positive. Not, not only was I the last person to see his cat, I was the last person his cat fucking saw. <laughs> I didn't really hurt them. I bought one of them things that's like, like a little box. Uh, it emits a high pitched frequency. It's inaudible to a human, but cats don't like it, so I bought one of them and I tied it to his collar. Um, <laughs> 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 not very really graceful, too, fucking like. <laughs> but yeah, he's. Uh, how can I describe an next door neighbour? His name's Dave. And um, he's a PE teacher, he's like six foot three, he's, he's good looking and, and quite charming. He's a fucking wanker, you know. <laughs> <laughs> and, um, he's, so he's always got something chirpy to fucking say. And, uh, I, I, it's like if you could paint the fence, you say, oh, could you paint? Anyway, right, cut on the story short. It's Sunday morning, I'm, mo I'm mushing the car, and I hear him coming along whistling happily, just fucking mind me up. And, uh, <laughs> I waited, and sure enough, right, he said, Andy, when you're finished with yours, can you leave the shanty out and give mine the once over? Well, it was a shit morning, right? And uh, I couldn't stop myself. I said, Dave, I'd love to, but your ass is asking me to back scutter over the bonnet <laughs> while, while your sister eats ice cream out my ass. <laughs> Do it tomorrow, if it's still on the floor, do it tomorrow.